Hey guys, Silver Stacker 999 coming at you again. Got another order in today from Provident. Um, it's the one I told you guys in my first video about that I ordered. Um, it kind of go hand in hand with these Fiji Takus, the uh, the Niui Turtles are what I picked up. I also went ahead at that time and picked up two more of the Zombux um, Merc Diems. I know I said in that first video that that one was going to be my last one for that series. However, I'm, I'm really glad that I picked up uh, more because they were the lowest mintage of the series so far. So, I am glad about that. Uh, first thing I noticed while opening this is that I did get another lanyard. So, I've got two lanyards now. So, no use for them yet, but I'll come up with something. Um, My packing slip. So, I really like these turtles. <clears throat> they basically have the same exact look. Now I don't know why um, the New Zealand Mint started making the just the generic turtle name instead of saying the Fiji Taku. I don't know if it's a licensing thing. Maybe somebody can um, clue me in on that or something. But they, they did only mint 200,000 of these um, this year, so which to me is good because that means there's only 199,998 more of these out there somewhere. So I like those. Now, I, everybody's seen these already, but I think the mintage on these is only 37,000. So let me know what you guys think about these pickups. You know, nothing real elaborate or big this time, but uh, I, I I do like the turtles. I might pick up a couple more, might not. Probably won't. I would like to, but just finances and everything, everybody can relate to that. Um, but yeah, so let me know what you guys think about this haul. Here they are out of their coin flips, guys. You guys get another view of them here. I really like these, uh, these Niui turtles. I like how... Um, and I don't know the terminology for a lot of this stuff, guys, so please help me out. But I like how the, the queen is the shiny part and the background is kind of frosted. I like that as opposed to the more modern or most coins that we see now where, like, I guess the eagles are all frosted. Um, the minted part and the background. But I, I love the, the, is that called high relief? Is that what that's called? I don't know. But I, I do like it, so... And I will probably take these Zombucks Merc DMs and flip them. Um, I might wait a while, a couple months, or maybe till the end of the series, who knows. I wonder if there will be much demand for these after the series is over, because people will probably, for the most part, think I can't get them anymore. So. so there you have them in their capsules. Huge fan of these coins. You kind of see some hairline uh, scratches on the queen, on queenie there. But I think that's pretty, um, pretty common in minting that there will be hairline scratches on things. And you know, unless it's like a proof or or something like that, I feel like that's a pretty common thing that you're going to see. I wanted to show you one more thing, guys. Just to prove that they are still out there. So coin roll searchers aren't as crazy as we all think. Got this and some change today. So definitely going to be adding that to my constitutional rolls. And you know it's kind of a. <clears throat> hey there's still stuff out there. People are still putting this in circulation. So keep an eye out. Keep looking for them. You know check every quarter every dime. Because you might not. You, you know you might get them and not realize it. So. I did also want to kind of clue you guys in on the fact that here coming up soon I will be um, giving away a round or coin of some type. I'm going to come up with some kind of a uh, some kind of a drawing or raffle or something for my subscribers. Well there you guys have it. four more ounces added to the stack. Let me know what you guys think about these. You know I 
to me, all silver is collectible, but are these more collectible than another? Do you think they are? I think they are. Only 200,000 minted makes it a real nice flippable coin, especially if there's going to be a, you know somebody that really wants this in the future. So, to me, that makes 2014 a key date. I don't know what the mintage on them yet next year is yet. But, <clears throat> and of course, the zone box is always good. It's It's been real popular. So, you know, I hope to flip those and buy more bullion. But I've got one more big order on the way yet. It's uh, the JM order um, for the Privy rounds that they had, or the Pri Privy Britannias that they had last week. I think they still have them, but not quite as good of a deal. So when those get here, I'll do an unboxing of those. And th that might be my last big order for a while, except for the, um, the Provident Mint Hercules series. Um, and that's that'll be a few weeks out yet until that'll come in. So... Uh, this will be my last video for the next week or so. Um, I might I might come up with my um, like I said earlier, might come up with the uh, coin drawing sometime this week and release a video or early next week. It'll probably be probably probably I'm leaning towards giving away one of these. I know it's just one, but I'm a beginner and and who doesn't like a free silver American Eagle? So let me let me know what you guys think. Like and subscribe and take her easy.